Hello friends, welcome to Insights Icon Initiative. In today's video, we are going to discuss about what is the global stock take as well as we will discuss about some concept regarding the environment such as COP meeting and we will discuss about International Solar Alliance, IPCC and COP27 and 28. Before we discuss further of today's topic, first let us try to understand what is the theme of the day. Okay, so today's theme of the day is the environmental convention when you are reading environmental convention what are your focused areas must be so first you have to look at these areas so this is very important especially when you are referring the current affairs because when you are referring current affairs you will read lot of environment related conventions now let's see first you have to check objective and uh, which convention that meeting is going on or which treaty under that meeting going on how many members are in that whether india is ratified the convention or not where is the headquarter of the convention in which year that particular convention was started related declaration such as you know like paris declaration or delhi declaration doha declaration like that any declarations are there recent cop meetings okay and uh, what are the targets of these conventions tell me students by the way when wa where was the co first cop meeting was held okay first cop meeting was held at which place so these are the focused areas regarding any environmental convention you have to focus on next so let's see how the questions can be framed the partnership for action on green economy it is a union eco un mechanism to assist countries transition towards greener and more inclusive economies emerged it that means this particular mechanism was emerged at where the question is asking this is about in the UN Conference on Sustainable Development 2012 at Rio de Janeiro. Again, I am saying that this these kind of questions try to understand how the questions are framing. Don't worry much about the answers. Question framing and uh, which, uh, which are the focused areas related to this particular concept that you have to check. Let's see one more question. Momentum for change. Climate neutral now is an initiative launched by. So this, these are these are another type of question is they will give the initiative name and they will ask you in which year it launched or else under which organization it was launched so that are certain type of question is the UNFCCC secretariat this secretariat it launched this initiative so these are the two sample questions related to environment convention and hope this helps to you now come back to today's topic what is a global stock take first by the way I'll help you regarding this topic. Global stock take means obviously countries decided their climate targets in various meetings such as COP21, Montreal, Kyoto, COP27, COP28. We are deciding targets. But the thing is, how successfully we are evaluating our targets? How successfully we are assessing our targets? Obviously, there must be a mechanism that we have to check how effectively we are reaching our targets whether there are any course corrections are required or not are we deviating for our from our targets or not that kind of assessment is nothing but what global stock take nothing but global stock take now we are going to discuss about very soon the first report of the global stock take will be released uh, where it is going to be released and further details we will understand first we will understand the context then global stock take what is cop Kyoto Protocol, Paris Agreement and COP27 and finally we will discuss about net zero as well because this year COP27 one of the focused area is net zero. Meanwhile if you know what is the target year for India to achieve the net zero put your answer in comment section okay what is the target year for India. This particular topic is related to GS paper 3 environment ecology and climate change first we have to understand why it is in news. International Solar Alliance for the first time they'll compile and they release global solar stock take report. Here global solar stock take means what? The assessment of the generation of the solar energy. How effectively they are generating the solar energy, whether they are meeting the targets or not, or any course corrections are required or not, and what are the challenges in solar stock take. So they discuss only about the solar stock take. If it is a climate stock take means it talks about the climate targets in general. So regarding the International Solar Alliance, you know that students, India and France both launched the International Solar Alliance. It is a group of countries which are located between the Tropic of Cancer and Tropic of Capricorn. International Solar Alliance, it was launched at COP21 2015 Paris. 
COP meetings are also known as formerly UNFCCC, United Nations Framework Convention on Climate Change. Headquarter, International Solar Agency, Headquarter, India, Secretariat set, set up at Gurugram. 120 countries participated and it is one of the largest grouping of countries after the UNO. Actually, previously one UPSC question was on this particular area that was about the one sun, one world, one grid. This is also related to International Solar Regions. This is also one of the initiative proposed by India. What is the vision of the International Solar Alliance? The vision is, let us together make the sun brighter. It includes using of solar energy in a very effective manner. Mission, every home, no matter how far away, will have a light at home. Okay, that means giving the sustainable energy even at a very remote area as well. This ISC, it was steered by India and France and this it was scheduled to hold 6th annual meeting in Delhi very soon. In this meeting, they are going to release the solar energy stock take. Focused areas of this ISA are installing the solar energy related free infrastructure in Africa and setting up of the global solar facility. So remember, global solar facility is the funding mechanism for generating the solar energy. How you will raise funds? That is about the global solar facility. I'll tell you very soon. Once the appropriate solar installation or solar infra set up in Africa, it will be further expanded into areas such as West Asia, Latin America and the Caribbean. Global solar facility. It is, was approved in the fifth session of the ISA assembly. Fifth session. It was held in India in 2022. And later it was discussed in 20, I mean COP27 which was held in Sharm el-Sheikh. I told you a number of times, Sharm el-Sheikh present in Sinai Peninsula of Egypt. Mandate. Global solar facility that uh, significance is to attack the investment into solar energy. Around how much uh, investment they would like to attract? Around $1 trillion in solar investment. By when? By 2030. So that they can overcome the challenges in generating the adequate solar energy and they can uh, give that benefits of solar energy even to the remotest part of the world. Global solar facility will attract funding from three various types. Payment guarantee fund, an insurance fund to cover the project risk and finally investment fund for technical assistance. These are the three different types of funds as it is very useful especially when you are solving the MCQs. Next, what is global stock, global stock take? So this is we are not dealing with you no know, solar stock take we are generally talking about the global stock take like i mentioned earlier global stock take is all about assessment of progress regarding the achievement towards the climate goals it's a global stock take is all about the un nations conference of parties cop assessment their progress which progress the goals which were agreed in cop 21 that is 2015 if any changes is required then course corrections will be done to those particular efforts this global stock take it is two years process and it will be scheduled to happen for every five years for example global stock take assessment started in 2022 for example in 2024 the report will be released again after five years global stock take report will be released five years means again in 2027 it will be started same like finance commission kind of thing for every five years the first global stock take it is going to be okay started into i mean it started in 2022 and it will be concluded in cop 28 that is 2024 in this two years study that will be revealed the objective coordinating the efforts towards the mitigating of climate action the solar stock take it will be released in november 2023 remember Solar stock take is about only solar that will be released in November 2023. Global stock talk is reg stock take regarding the global climate actions. So it will be released in 2024. Regarding the you know like uh, solar energy, nearly 300 billion of investment took place in 2020 and around 380 billion dollars are expecting in 2022. In 2021, investments were not up to the mark because of the global pandemic such as COVID. And still these investments are uneven and still majority of the solar production is happening in China and we are depending excessively on that particular country and the findings. So this global stock talk finding is all about 
when we are done our assessment it is revealing that we are not uh, going towards the towards reaching the targets which were fixed in the cop 21 in cop 21 we fixed targets such as our temperature should be within 2 degrees compared to the pre industrial level by 2100 and if possible we can keep that temperature up to i mean within 1.5 degrees but it is not going to be happen because lack of commitment from various countries and regarding the environment here i would like to mention few important concepts regarding the environment every year there will be one annual meeting will be happen to check what kind of climate changes are happening and what kind of climate mitigation we can adopt those things will be discussed in every year in annual meetings those annual meetings are nothing but cop conference of parties here they will assess the progress which was made in the climate change first cop meeting was held in berlin in 1995 and every member country has equal voting power and unanimous approval is required for any cop agreement because of this clause only cop 27 got delayed in cop 27 the underdeveloped countries especially island countries they demanded for the loss and damage fund initially it was not i mean all the member countries did not come to an agreement and after a couple of days of delay finally all the member countries agreed and they adopted the loss and damage fund kyoto protocol 1997 this was one of the significant cop meeting here here this protocol is mainly was mainly focused on reducing the greenhouse gas emissions the treaty it was a result of cop third okay cop third meeting a third cop meeting paris agreement 2015 it was cop 21 here we decided that compared to pre industrial level we have to check we have to limit the global temperature within 2 degrees if possible within 1.5 degrees actually in this platform itself india proposed international solar alliance with france cop 27 it was held in shermel sheikh and here all the member countries the organization had rejected about 1.5 degrees pathway is not achievable and in cop 27 we also adopted the loss and damage control fund and in this particular meeting can member nations also discussed about the net zero emissions net zero emission is all about the amount of carbon emissions entering into atmosphere and the amount of carbon emissions removing from atmosphere they will be equal that is known as net zero carbon carbon emissions are equal to the amount they removed so to achieve this what we have to do we have to decarbonization that means we should reduce the amount of carbon emissions which are entering into the atmosphere or your environment as well as carbon removal solution should be developed as well so through that we can achieve the net carbon zero next un triple c cop 28 cop 28 meeting scheduled in expo city dubai and this will feature the first global stock take that means we started the global stock take in 2022 and in this cop 28 this global stock take report will be released and will come to know how far we reached how far our progress been there regarding in reaching of cop 21 targets whether we require any course correction or not and whether we require any further reforms or further improvements or not we will come to know in the global stock take report and cop 28 will mainly focus on climate adaptation initiative so this is also very important students because because of the climate change small nations and island nations they are suffering a lot compared to the developed nations at one point at one side we have to prevent the uh, global warming and the other side we have to adapt to the we have to adapt to the consequences related to the climate change so adaptation is also very important what is the conclusion overall the global stock take emphasizing the urgency of action to mitigate the global warming it will emphasize obviously it will give the data that what kind of actions we have to take okay so re with regular data helps you in doing course correction next yesterday's video question it was regarding the article 142 with reference to constitution of india prohibition or provisions contained in ordinary law they cannot act they cannot restrain court power under article 142 it means which one of the following it means obviously state legislature cannot make laws on certain matters without the concurrence of union legislature okay so especially in the concurrent subjects 
next today's video question what is the rio plus 20 conference often mentioned in the news read these four statements and pick the right answer regarding the rio plus 20 conference my question what are the implications of changing climate on various aspect of indian region implications of changing climate what are the implications elaborate upon the key actions taken by india towards combating and adapting climate change so to cut to combat the climate change and to adapt towards the climate change what kind of action indian government undertook so this is the main question now as we reach to the end of this video we'll revise very quickly in this particular video we discussed about the theme of the day apart from that we also discussed about the solar uh, stock take apart from the solar stock take even we discussed about the global stock take cop meeting international solar alliance and we also discussed about what happened in cop 27 and what are the things what are the things we can expect in cop 28 we discussed this particular issues and this is the detailed analysis regarding the global stock take as well as solar stock take 